everybody hi everyone welcome to our new video uh, today we're gonna teach you how to stop Ubuntu or uh, any kind of uh, Linux to, to to stop asking you password whenever you log in to terminal so every time when I log in uh, by default Ubuntu ask me for the password so whatever I do they ask me for the password I want to sudo to a file I'll have to put in a password I have to I want to update the system they ask me for the password I, I want to to vi a file they ask me for the password so time comes like uh, it chows a lot of time and is something which you cannot uh, stand all the time so now we're gonna show you how to do that in few seconds so what you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your terminal first when you're there then we start our work okay so make sure you know your username and password because you cannot do that first without those two so now if you have that username and password you just log in and say terminal when you're on terminal you say okay yes look I want to sudo sudo so they ask me for the password you get me okay then I put in my password uh, it's something I don't like so even if I start a new session here and I cancel here and I'm um, on the new session and I say VI or oh, let me say uh, so let me say sudo uh, sudo apt uh, get update I want to update my system when I say that they ask me for the password something I, d I really don't like uh, I'm not happy with that so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna show you how to stop that and you're gonna fly like an eagle now so what we're gonna do is we're gonna stop that what you do is um, try to first of all do this is the command you're gonna go in with says sudo uh, you're gonna go to the sudo as files file so so that we change that we're gonna have a vi uh, sudo it's one word remember in some files when you want to vi them you don't put you put vi space then you put the, 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 the file but here it's gonna be sudo vi sudo get me so you enter that they're gonna ask you the password for the last time in your life oh. right once you put in the password you can see that the file looks like this you get me they say this file must be edited with the vcsudo command as root understand so root person with the root privileges is the only one who's gonna do that so uh, they say please consider adding local content in etc sudoers.d instead of directly modifying this file right they say you can go on that file instead of doing this see the main page for details on how to write a sudoers file right go here and say default uh, you can see all that you don't have to be there leave that host uh, whatever user cmnd leave that so you go down go down the file should look like this and uh, once you reach here on the last page here you're gonna do something very simple you're gonna write for me this command the exact way you are so type in your username in my case it's Layla so put space uh, after putting space then you can say capital O or then say E uh, all of these letters after the username is gonna be capital so now what you're gonna do there's no space after the equal sign put no pass WD then after that then what you're gonna do you're gonna put what they call colony uh, then you say space and uh, say all say all after that press you can see they give you directions here but they're not going to give you what i'm going to give you they say get help g you press g exit x but here write out read file where is replace cut text paste whatever leave all that just press control and x control and X once you do that it's gonna say save modified buffer 
so what you're gonna do is gonna say yes for y and for no what do you want to do what we want to do is to save it i'm gonna say y then after that press enter after pressing enter you can see we not so do there but we managed to do that we put the name we don't want to ask them or whatever user what what sudo so asking password remember if you do it on one name it simply means gonna do only that name other people gonna be asked passwords all the time so me if now i wanna say sudo remember that uh, sudo so they will never ask me for the password i just log in you can see now they make me sudo at the same time you can see this so i can do anything i want then even to visit that thing i don't need anything anymore so i will just say vi sudo sudo they won't ask me for the password i just say enter i'm in right so to i'm gonna delete that to show you that it worked you saw that it worked but i'm gonna delete it then i s which means i'm taking away those privileges which i have already so let me do that quickly okay you do the same thing you go here and the delete backspace 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 after that press control x then you press y then you say enter then i'm here and i'm gonna say i'm gonna go to a new session here and i'm gonna delete this session say yes close terminal then i'm gonna say sudo so they're asking me for the password you get me so now you've seen that it's working i'm gonna go back and put it back and uh, they won't ask me for the password then we're gonna close our tutorial so what you do put in your password here then you enter after when you enter then you can say sudo you can say vi sudo sudo you enter when you here then you go to the last 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 to the end of this to whatever then you say Layla. in that case it's going to be a username space all equals to no pass wd then put that then space then say all then you don't do anything after doing that you're gonna be super good or super okay so right so now what you're gonna do you're gonna save by pressing ctrl x then you press y then you press enter then we can go back to see if that is there go to the end and you see it you can see it's there then exit which is gonna be control control x okay we send yes okay enter so right it's there so now i want to open a new session and I'll close this session i'm doing the same steps i did before so that you see i don't get any problems so sudo so remember last time when you did it they asked for a password sudo so and uh, you enter you can see it doesn't ask me any password so we don't have any problem anymore I can even update my Windows or my uh, Ubuntu and say up to get. Okay, let me even not do this. Let me go to another session. I'm gonna just say I'm gonna say apt get uh, update. Okay, I did. I'm updating my 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 system with no stress. Everything's done updating from search repository can be done securely and it is therefore a disabled by disabled by default you get me all these things you can me I, I can do anything so i just have some issues here which is no which are not even uh, related to what we're doing but i can do anything i can say sudo so i'm in i'm not supposed to be asked the password and they don't ask me one you get me so that's the reason why we made this course also me i was a bit frustrated by being asked the password whenever i log in so that's something i don't really like you get me so uh guys thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and uh if you see that we missed out something or you have you have something better than this you can show people some commands using our 
comment box then you comment there also if you can advise something we are welcoming any advice from you guys and also please don't forget to share on facebook like uh, share on twitter and everywhere so whenever you share our stuff and also whenever you subscribe you make us feel so uh, important and we do make more videos to help other people thanks for watching see you in the next video